Hi, this is Goggett, along with Mrs. Goggett. Good morning. And it's time for Sunday Drive with Goggett. Today's drive is going to be down Parkway Drive and Marsha Sharp Freeway. I had one of my viewers uh, ask that I do a, the Marsha Sharp Freeway, uh, and her name is Carolyn Pias. Uh, she left a comment and said that she lived in Lubbock for 10 years and moved to uh, north, northwestern Arkansas. And during the time when she was uh, uh, living here in Lubbock, uh, the Marshall Sharp Freeway wasn't built. So she asked uh, if I could do a driving video with the Marshall Sharp Freeway. So uh, I haven't done that one. So I'm going to go ahead and that's what we're doing today. Supposed to rain today, sixty uh, percent. Yes, it is. We're due for some rain. Yeah, and and the thing is, it's uh, uh, not supposed to be any severe thunderstorms. They said it might have thunderstorms and winds in excess of fifty miles an hour with the thunderstorms, but it's not going to uh, be uh, severe. It took a while to build this uh, Marsha Sharp Freeway. I don't know how many years, it seemed like forever. Texas Tech pulled it out. Somehow they came back. Well, they, they were what down by two touchdowns. The three. first three touchdowns. What the first quarter? Mm -hmm. and they come back to win. What was it? it was thirty-eight to uh, twenty-one? Twenty-one. And at the last quarter, they really pulled out. Well, they were really pulled out. So they got one win. They uh, they were playing the. University, University, Houston Cougars, yeah. Patrick Mahomes was there. Yeah, McCombs was up there in the uh, wine and cheese section. He was up there watching the game while he was having fun. Yeah. Every time Tech scored, he went up there and clapped his hands and he was hollering. Yeah, he, he was there and Order of the Red Raiders. Well, he used to be a quarterback of the Red Raiders. Yeah, he did. They had a. The other team had a. One of the coaches that was with Tech, you know, that funny saying that Black Tech says, Wreck of Tech, that's the Tech slogan. And the other guy says, Now we're going to wreck Tech. Yeah. And their trip backfired on him. It backfired on him. I think, yeah, you might know it, him. It didn't happen. And then you started off good, but you ended up just as much starting. I'm getting some raindrops on my. Let me kind of clean this off and see if it going to affect the video. But yeah, hopefully 
Tech, I have a good team this year. Mm -hmm. I haven't been to a bowl game in a while. Like they said, the coach went out and recruited a bunch of good ones they from that were from different colleges that you know, made up high school or just got out of high school or just yeah. went from, you know, they're, and they came back and um, they got some good ones. I'd say it took Manila a bit to get going, but one, when they got going, they didn't stop. They might have a pretty good team this year. I don't know. You know, they start out pretty good and then they mess up in the end. They said they had a tough schedule this year. They got a tough schedule going. Tough schedule? Yeah. Not no. Um, They're playing the same people that play every year, don't they? Well, they got a couple of different ones. <coughs> teams that were in here that are. I haven't seen the schedule. I saw it, but I just took a glance of it uh, at uh, Market Street that had it up mm -hmm. right there. Well, I have to get online and print one out. So. Yeah, we were just taking off and running into my son around the corner of the block. Yeah, he was, was out. From, you know, yeah, he works for the U.S. Mail and was delivering Amazon packages on Sunday. I, I didn't know they done did that. I, was, I used to see them out, the uh, mail trucks, you know, uh, and I didn't know the reason. I said, it's Sunday. They, they don't run on Sunday. And uh, it's just, uh, they have some kind of, he said they have some kind of contract with Amazon and uh, to deliver packages. So that was a good guy. I was it was good to see him. Yeah. Shout out to Tim. Looking good, looking happy. Yeah. Yeah. That's how you that you know got a good job with the post office. Yeah. They got a lot of good benefits. Sure was a good meatloaf you made last night, Mrs. Scoggin. Oh, thank you. You always make a good meatloaf. Besides, uh, we have your good. yeah, we have your recipe on on the channel also. So if you guys want a good meatloaf, just check out my channel and uh, look that up. Yeah, they do that. They uh, have those Halloween stores. And they come once a year, make a killing. Yeah. I think they got one over there on Slide Road too. Can you get me open this one? Okay. Yeah, they uh, went back this way too. I think one out back over here. They just they had Halloween all across the building. Yeah.
Yeah, this freeway, it goes quite a ways, but then it's fixing to end up here, so that's where this video ends whenever we uh, get off up here. Because then, then what it does is instead of the Marshall Sharp Freeway, it turns into the uh, Brownfield Highway. Oh. It goes to Brownfield. Yeah. Okay. And this is where it ends, right here. You know, this exit. Well, this is the end of our uh, Sunday drive this week. Uh, this is where the Marshall Sharp freeway, freeway ends and the Brownfield Highway begins. So I uh, hope everybody enjoyed the video. Uh, we enjoyed having you uh, come along with us. Y'all continue to stay safe out there and, and take care. Hi, everybody.